So just going to show you guys a little trick I came up with because, uh, uh, you know, I'm, I'm running ladder line. And um, it just doesn't do 160. And so take this crappy coax that I got here. I put the ground to the ground and I put the center up here to my 4 to 1 ballon in here. So normally with this, you would jumper that one to that one and it would go over to the switch here and allow you to select balance line or you know whatever so this is the ladder line coming in it's going into this you can do this with any of the mfjs as long as you know what your wires are so almost all of them work this way so like it says here install a jumper for balance line operation so normally you would put your jumper here and it would connect here and you go to the front and select wire balance line but you couldn't bypass it there's no way to bypass it so because in some instances you know you'd be better off to use your radio's built-in tuner than using this piece of junk these are susceptible to all sorts of problems i got this from somebody else they caught this thing on fire a few times um lots of things wrong with it this has blown up uh the, the dummy load reads about 70 ohms but anyway um, these are decent, but, uh, these are a good candidate, you know, to rebuild if you can get a really old school ceramic roller inductor, but, um, I'm just experimenting with it, uh, and this is a technique that you can use to feed your ladder line and go through coax one instead and, you know, transform that, you know, four to, four to one deal. And then you can still put coax one in bypass mode. So like in my case, I'm using my radio's built-in tuner on 160 meters rather than trying to fiddle with this thing. So anyway, thanks for watching.